Welcome to another M Squares Vancouver Talks. Today we're at UBC campus and today's question is if two people find each other attractive, can they just be friends? And to elaborate on that question, we're also asking if two people have been friends for a long time and one of them develops feelings for the other one, should that one tell the other one about those feelings? Or should they keep it to themselves and lock it up and ignore those feelings? First question, if two people find each other attractive, can they just be friends? Yes, yes. Most of my friends I find, I'm bisexual, so most of my girlfriends are like, no, don't worry. <laughs> She's like, mm. I'm, I'm semi bi, don't worry. <laughs> okay, most of my friends that I find attractive, I'm like, I'm, I have to be friends with them. <laughs> but boys as well, a lot of my guy friends are really attractive, but there's usually some other reason why we're not dating. Like, okay. either they smell really bad or like, <laughs> Yeah, guys, stop, stop with that deal. Uh, yeah. Guys, come on, like, use some deodorant. I'd say so. Yeah. I think that that's a really old myth that doesn't... It's kind of sexist, in a way, on both sides, to assume that you can't control your feelings and your hormones. Yeah. I don't see why you couldn't be friends with someone because they're a different gender than you. If you have the same interests and you get along, there's no reason that you wouldn't be able to be friends. Yes. Yeah, they're possible. both attracted to each other? Yeah. Absolutely. I mean, you could find other people good looking, but attracted I feel is different, so no. No? Like, I could think Christina is a good looking person, I mean, you're but still, you're I'm not attracted to her. Ah. <laughs> yeah, to me, attracted means like. So that, that key word, attracted? Yeah, yeah. It means something different, I think. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. No. Alright. No way. Why? Why? You guys, you guys explain. Oh, me? Why? Yeah, why? Because, like, let's say I'm dating a girl right now another girl attractive right she's like yeah i'd smash and i'm like i'm like yo but i'm committed and she's like all right that's cool cool and then we just be friends okay so the situation there okay oh, i mean like it's bound to happen right like, you guys are both attracted to each other right okay so like nature's gotta take its course <clears throat> yeah exactly yes elaborate yes well i mean you don't have to date someone you like you can just be friends with them it's not that hard <laughs> and it goes the same for the guys as well yes. as girls Yes. Okay, okay, so it's simple. Straight up, straight up, yes, okay. I find plenty of my friends attractive, but I wouldn't necessarily date any of them because I need to feel that extra, like, something to yeah. be able to date them. Sometimes you just see someone, like, even if you find them attractive, you acknowledge that they're good-looking, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they have what it takes yeah. to be in a relationship with okay. you, you know what I'm saying? Understand. It makes sense. Yeah. So you that, that click, that connection. Exactly. Yeah. You can't just depend on <laughs> your friends. I think you can still be friends. I don't know. Like, it just doesn't mean you have to act on it, I guess. But so that could be a problem if they're drunk and they're like, nah, then all your like subconsciousness goes away. I think it's Maybe. a little thing called self. I think it also, but... yeah, it also depends on like, are they both single? Like, depends. Their cir circumstances might be different. Cool. And yeah, you guys know. You guys must have some ideas on that topic. No problem. Okay. Hey, David. No problem. Hey. Hey. <laughs> no question. No question. <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> forever long, <laughs> I'm get in forever long. Get in trouble, that's pretty funny. I'm gonna elaborate on that one. Okay, so let's just say you and your friend, um, you had a friend for a long time. It doesn't have to be you, but it could be like one of your friends, just through experience or a story you might have. Um, if they've been friends for a long time and feelings start to develop, either on one side, should that person withhold their feelings, not tell them? Ignore the feelings? Should they actually speak up about the feelings? It's a tough one. Because you don't want to ruin the friendship if they don't feel the same yeah. way. But at the same time, if they do feel the same way, then it could be an amazing relationship. Yeah. Or it could just make everything awkward. If it was personally, like if it was me, I'd tell them. Because I wouldn't be able to like be the be the same with feelings. Okay. So put it on the table. First. Yeah, I'd just be like, yo, so I like you now. <laughs> but like, I know a lot of people that wouldn't do that. Yeah, I wouldn't. Like I was in love with my best guy friend for three years and I never told him. Oh, Turns years. out he liked me too. But oh. <laughs> See, you should have told him. Oh, you get a hug for that. Oh, thank you. It's okay. I don't know how you feel. <laughs> how you feel. Yeah. It's, it's difficult because you, you have that friendship, I think. Yeah, so you don't really know where you're supposed to take it. Yeah. yeah. Sadness. It's that, it's that line, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you could have got out of the friend zone. <sighs> exactly. See? This is why my thing works. 
<laughs> I've done that actually, you know, I've told a boy that I've liked him and then he's been like, yeah, I don't feel the same way. Okay. And then after like about a month, it was back to normal. Okay. Like, we just kind of ignored it. And then to be honest, once he said he didn't like me, I kind of started, like, you move on. Yeah, and I exactly. found somebody else you to like, be true about it, right? Yeah. 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 Not be like little high school. Mm-hmm. Girl. Oh my god, he doesn't like me. Yeah, he's like. a pillow for a week. Well, that was, that was me. For like a week. Oh. <laughs> I, I did Whoops. both, yeah. <laughs> I think like it's always better to tell someone. I think it's just always in better. case it's reciprocated. Yeah. And plus, the other person probably knows to some degree. I mean, right? If you're like really good friends with this person, you could probably tell that they're developing feelings to you, and it would be better to just have it out in the open. I think it's always better just to be honest. Yeah. Up front, clear. Not totally agree, yeah. I love you, adds it right at the end. Yeah, I like to be honest, straightforward, I would tell. You tell? Yeah, otherwise you get maybe in complicated situations, so... Oh, yeah. And then, yeah. avoid it. Oh. <laughs> tell them. Tell them? Yeah. Mm. Fucking just shoot for it, you know what I mean? And then, like, if it doesn't work out, just be like, alright, cool. And then and move on. move on. Yeah, exactly. Cool. Right, guys, man. Yeah. I agree. I agree? I agree. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah? Oh, okay. I think I'll do that, too. Truth. Truth. Hashtag truth. If you pretend it doesn't happen, that's not a healthy way to go about it, and you're going to end up getting hurt in the long run. I think that if you're close enough with them that you've developed these feelings, you should be open about that with them. them know. And either they'll be receptive because they're good friends with you and they'll be able to work through it with you if they don't have the same feelings, yeah. or they'll have the same feelings as you do, yeah. and you guys can develop a relationship from there. But I think that ignoring it's not going to go well at all. It's just going to build, I think. Yeah. Yeah, and then it's gonna First. become worse for you in the relationship, and your friendship's yeah. not gonna last long. Not a club. Not, not a club. Yeah, definitely no, not a club. No. Why is that? Because those hoes ain't gonna be loyal. Yeah. <laughs> they're actually really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're not. Hashtag hoes not loyal. Yeah. No. <laughs> never, never. It can't trust no hoes. <laughs>